Talonator, and so in this video, what? Okay, well, um, yeah, I did a, um, a nine hour stream Whoa. in this episode. Um, basically, we're going to be, uh, doing some things. So, yeah. Now, as you can see right here, I actually found a Freddy Fazbear's location, so we might actually go there in this episode. I'm not too sure. But I found a location. And, uh... Yeah. Very fun. I also increased the iron farm capacity. And I also started walking on building up the, um... So here's the new chest. Just the new armory. Got some more stuff. I got a... USAS 12 it's not even that expensive and it completely shreds the wither so you know also I have 12 skulls so you know what's gonna happen in the next episode and I started walking on getting all of the deep slate tiles and I'm eventually gonna do the roof on the next stream but I wanted to make a drill and I've been putting off making this episode for so long so you know yeah, we're gonna make a drill and a refinery, and potentially when I'm making the refinery, I'm gonna make a buzz saw because I also need one of those. So yeah, I have all of these fucking schematics, and there's so many. So yeah. Anyways, I have an engineer's blueprint right here. I have some stuff. And just like in the previous series, episode 4 is when I make my drill in the refinery. But this time, it's going to be way better. So, yeah, we're going to make the drill completely on camera. No cuts, no nothing. So first, here is the two steel drill heads I'm going to make today. I'm making two because I know I'm going to need two. And, yeah. So, we're also going to look up drill. So, for mining drill, I need a iron mechanical component. And then I need two wooden grips right there. But first, I need a heavy engineering block. Yay. So, I'm going to craft up these steel plates. I'm also going to craft up these steel plates. Four of the plates will be used to construct sheet metal. And the rest of them will be used to make steel mechanical components. All of this together combines into a heavy engineering block, four of them. Which means I can make a mining drill right here. Yay! But that's not it. Because now... I can put a drill head, yay, on here. So now we have a mining drill with drill head. However, we do not have any fuel, sad. But we will get some fuel in a second. We're gonna make some advanced ruggers right here, or ruggers, whatever. We need three iron mechanical components. So we're gonna use these. We're gonna get free iron mechanical components. Take the nine steel we have. We got the ruggers. There we go. Then we need a large tank, which is another iron mechanical component. I know, so many of them. You can actually buy iron mechanical components, and I really need to get a villager to sell me iron mechanical components. Because I use so many of them. And I need two steel. Two red dye and two buckets and I get a large tank and for now that's all I'm going to make I'm going to make a few more things um, you know later on but for now that is everything I do want to make a few um a few other things so I'm gonna head over here I'm just gonna quickly make um, Um, some of these 
These are jerry cans I'm making right here. I'm gonna make a few jerry cans because I know I'm gonna need them for the um the never expedition. So, you know. Might as well make them now. There you go, make a few jerry cans. And now we're all good. So, yeah. That was the quick little thing right there. I just wanted to do that real quick. So yeah, now I have jerry cans. And I'm probably also gonna make a few backpacks in the time lap and the time lapse I'm gonna do here. But yeah, now we have the mining drill. Yay. And also I downloaded a um a new mod. I don't know if you ever heard of it. It's called the Starryite mod. I don't I don't know. <laughs> I made this mod. That's why you can't find it. Yeah. I made my own mod. <laughs> um I really wanted a very powerful set of armor and tools. So I decided to make my own um my own mod and also my own resource packs. So there you go. And actually right now we're gonna turn off all of these under the starry, goodbye. Starry to Tyler or Starry to Nader, goodbye. We don't talk about cough cough. Never to Ender, we don't care about right now. These are the only ones we want. So yeah, I'm going to turn off those resource packs. And when we get the items, we will re-enable them. Yeah, basically, I made a new mod with new armor and tools and such. And basically, all of those resource packs... Um, change other mods like Neverite stuff into Starryite and also some Enderite stuff into Starryite and that's all they do and then there's one that turns um, into like what I wear in real life and then there's also one that um, we don't talk about that one it's fine anyways yeah I'm going to oh, I actually do have a lot of leather and tons of okay I could probably make the backpack either way I am going to right now make the refinery so um yeah I'm gonna gather all of these resources and I also need some gunpowder and thankfully this turning nighttime so I can gather some gunpowder I need some for bullets and also for the um, schematic cannon because it actually needs gunpowder to use. Also, I got really confused for a second. There's different fluid pipes. Forgot about that, but whatever. Anyways, cut to the time lapse of me completely and entirely getting a refinery set up for my drill. Also, this is a much better refinery I'm gonna make, so. Yeah, start the time lapse. This is going to take forever. Ugh.
Alright people, so after that little time lapse, we now have all of this stuff in the chest. And that was it for the schematic cannon. So now, we're going to be building the structure. Yay. So, yeah. We're going to let this placing begin. And yeah. There's the down layer. So I improved the um, refinery here by making it one constant stream. So I discovered that the um, the fluid actually does flow in between uh, multi-blocks, even if there's no actual pipe. With just the multi-block pipe, it actually still walks, which is very nice. You see, I have diamond generators, which is a new mod I downloaded for some power. Those are item pipes, you know what those are. And it's done. Should be done. Done. Only took a hundred shots. Yeah, that is now done. We can now fully configure this. And we can start producing some biodiesel. That is now fully configured, though. After all the bone and Atlanta, there it is. We're done. Yay! So basically, these uh, diamond generators are essentially just better than setting up thermal electrics. At least for me. That's why I'm using those. And then pipe upgrade there. And then we'll also put a pipe upgrade here. And I guess we'll save the other pipe upgrade. I'm not too sure why I got the other one. <laughs> I don't really need it. But yeah, to properly use that refinery, I need some hemp seeds. Or something so I can actually use it we also need some plant oil so I can get um, the other thing I need plant oil <laughs> kind of badly yeah refinery it's finally set up I've been meaning to get this thing for ages yeah we can dump a bunch of coal in all of these and that auto supplies all of the um, machines so now these are all at full power. They won't stay like that. <laughs> Guarantee it. We're going to mine up some of this sugar cane I have set up. And the nice thing about this new setup that I made is I can easily just deposit sugar cane and then it will now kind of just walk. So, very nice. Alright. We now have biodiesel we have produced biodiesel not a lot but we have some technically that isn't enough for ancient debris definitely is not enough that's why i really need some of this for ancient debris but hey it's a start okay now i can make one cool Pretty sure it's the other way around. Nope. Never mind. Okay, that's one. I only really need the one, but I'll take the other. Okay, done. Cool. Now what we can do is craft the second one I need. So it is on the bottom. Exactly like that. There we go. Two advanced lubrication systems. We are fully done. Yay! So now we have a buzz saw, and we also have the drill, and they're both going to be fully. What the fuck? What in the universe? Okay, whatever. They're both fully maxed out now. It's fine. 
put the buzz saw in here. So about whenever the barrel was all full, I can get my jerry cans wolf, basically. Yeah. That's enough capacity for me, at least right now. I don't really need that much capacity currently. I only really need, you know, a few jerry cans. So I'm having... I have a new way that I'm going to get a ton of ancient debris, and it requires a ton of AFKing. Like, I'm going to sit and wait for like 10 years. Because I actually designed an ancient debris farm, and Resymph is finally useful, and that's why you saw me purposefully gathering mineral rocks. Because they're actually kind of useful. Kind of. They will be useful eventually. But. For now, Talonator, signing out. Bye, like, comment, subscribe. Hit the bell to get notified. Kevin. When I get, um, Staryite armor, eventually. It will take a while, but I'm going to get Staryite. So, uh, yeah, stay tuned.